Hello. Please hit like button and subscribe my channel. Also press bell icon for future video notifications. Thanks. Ineos Automotive is closing the year with a few changes to its top management team. The company has announced that it will appoint a new CEO and a new COO as the automaker transitions from an engineering project to a commercial business. Ineos Automotive, part of Ineos Group, was formed in 2017 to design and build a utilitarian off-road vehicle that would become the Grenadier. The SUV finally entered production in October after facing supply chain issues that affected the entire auto industry. With the Grenadier now rolling off the assembly line, Ineos Automotive will have new management to lead the way. Lynn Calder will become the new CEO, assuming the role effective immediately. Hans-Peter Pessler will become the company's new coup formerly serving as a senior executive at Austria's Magna Steyr. Philippi Steyr will remain as the firm's president. Calder joins Ineos Automotive after spending six years in various positions within Ineos Group, including multiple CEO roles. She has previous experience in private equity. Calder said that, it's an exciting time, to take the reins of Ineos, praising the team for all its hard work while noting that, we're still only at the beginning of creating a global business. The Grenadier could come to the US, featuring the BMW sourced B58 twin turbocharged inline 6 engine. It produces 281 horsepower, 210 kilowatts, and 332 pound feet. 450 newton meters of torque the diesel version won't arrive in the u.s but it will be available in europe and make 245 horsepower 193 kilowatts and 406 pound feet 550 newton meters of torque the order books are open for the suv it's unclear what the future holds for ineos now that the grenadier is in production but we have an idea The automaker is developing a fuel cell electric vehicle version of the SUV, and testing was supposed to start by the end of 2022. Hydrogen continues to garner interest from automakers, big and small, even as they push headlong into developing new battery electric vehicles for the masses. Thanks for watching. Credits to www.motor1.com and Spied Build LLC. Please subscribe my channel for more auto updates.